kumiyakat lugaw iya almost three days na daka kanda turog kasi subumba nagrabi subumba kasi wa in one day lang na nag many health facilities were destroyed and therefore the health services to the people were disrupted. During the uh, Marawi siege, 350,000 uh, people were displaced. More than two and a half years after the siege, 70,000 people are still remaining displaced. In the Philippines, care started in 1949 and has been providing assistance to people affected by different natural disasters as well as man-made crises. CARE has been working with the Abbott to address uh, and support people in emergency situations. During our work, Abbott realized that very often uh, the other needs, particularly non-communicable diseases such as hypertension and diabetes, are not being addressed. In the middle of uh, 2019, CARE and Abbott partnered with uh, our office to address the growing concern for non-communicable diseases. The goal of the project is to improve the quality of life of people who live in the different camps of Marawi, particularly people who are suffering from diabetes or hypertension or obesity. Abot ke kami akalala mini guperan agumada kal amra nau ake ugupaniran kase nagita pagilayan sa rogo pagilayan sa BP pagilayan sa sugar pagilayan sa timbangian pagilayan sa haitian pagilayan sa westian pagilayan sa hepian o pa mo anto na ikagulayan to na ikwanyan to na minti na pekenian o di magexercise kanyan o pa halala gira kapepita pa pagexercise Care globally focuses on women and girls because they are disproportionately affected by the humanitarian crisis and in emergencies. That's why they need additional support. We identified women who were either health workers before the displacement or retired from the health system and they are currently volunteering for the project. Inumada ka lang mga babay, may ag-inumeritor kasi kadaklan kasi imanto sa panahon ni Manto na di mag-late na sa mga babay. Imanto na mga galba ko mga babay, ay imanto interestado sa mga babay, may ag-lead sa kuwan, sa care, kaya pag-inumeritor kasi malbuda ka pa kakumbinsiran sa tao. Even though the project just started recently, we already see through the testing and monitoring that the sugar levels of the people that have been tested today, for instance, already have been reduced. Nabid no ba malakam ya kalalad na miniyugup git ah so di piki eksamin, di piki screen na sakya kumbinsa meron sakya pa kau maabot tapos. The key to address non-communicable diseases globally are effective teamwork, efficient coordination, and collaboration. And so we also hope that we will develop and we will create a model of addressing non-communicable diseases in emergencies that we can use in other areas of the Philippines and maybe globally.